That right there is my 10 month old Blue Bay Shepherd Kurgan and my two year old German Shepherd Lobo. And they're extremely excited because I have uh, the upper legs and shoulder blades of a uh, deer here for him. And this is a mukbang video. I hope you enjoy it. Oh, down. Very good. Down. 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 Go, Bo. I noticed when I started my camera, I accidentally left the flash on, which was not intentional. Eat some of the uh, frozen ice off of it. Now I'm going to repeat myself in this video from things I've said in other videos, but uh, that's all right. I uh, do that uh, because I assume people haven't seen these videos before and uh, so uh, I want to pass on some information. I feed myself or my dogs a uh, BARF diet. BARF is an acronym that stands for Biologically Appropriate Raw Foods. It was a uh, diet created by a Dr. Ian Billinghurst. He's got a couple of really good books on the topic that you can find on Amazon called uh, Give Your Dog a Bone and Grow Your Pups with Bones. If I remember, I'll put the link to that down below in the video description. Boy, I like to pet my dogs when they're eating this kind of stuff. Keeps them from getting uh, any kind of food aggression. I feed them this kind of stuff frozen because it slows them down a little bit when they're eating it so they don't uh, wolf it down so to speak. Now, as I often say, I don't pass myself off as uh, any kind of canine nutritionist or anything, so uh, take what I say with a grain of salt and do your research. I'm just some guy on YouTube. Whoa. This is the way canines are meant to eat. Raw bones are good for your dogs. It's cooked bones you never want to feed them. Cooking the bone uh, changes the consistency of the bone and uh, makes it hard for them to digest which can cause intestinal blockages, uh, perforate the bowel, etc. What are you here, buddy? Thank you. 
doesn't get much more biologically appropriate than uh, deer, huh? Kurgan is a Blue Bay Shepherd, 10 months old. He's out of uh, Frost and Ryder from uh, Southern Breeze Blue Bay Shepherds. A lot of people seem to like these mukbang videos, which is why I put them up. A lot of the uh, modern uh, skeletal diseases affecting uh, canines have to do with uh, overly uh, commercial uh, uh, dog foods. Part of the way you can help remedy some of those is uh, feeding a uh, raw diet. Off a big chunk there, eh, buddy? I'll shoot some uh, footage of Lobo over there eating, uh, probably in a second clip here. My uh, backyard starting to look like a uh, graveyard with all the venison bones from uh, all the deer they've been eating lately. My uh, brother-in-law got a deer uh, a couple of weeks ago and was kind enough to uh, give me some of the uh, parts that they don't eat uh, for my animals. And this is stuff that would be thrown away. so. Uh, Doing this allows uh, all of that uh, deer that was harvested in the wild to be uh, utilized. You can hear him munching right through that shoulder blade, eating pieces of the bone. That's what you want. You want them to eat and consume the bone. They will eat that whole piece there. It'll probably take several hours because it's frozen, but uh, there won't be much left when they're done. Kurgan currently is uh, 30 to 31 inches at the shoulders at 10 months and uh, probably a little over 100 pounds now. He's growing like a weed. He 
You know, if you have dogs that are suffering from allergies, often uh, feeding a raw diet can help uh, with that. Something just fell out of my tree, my big oak tree. It's full of squirrels. See, he's munching through that uh, shoulder blade, no problem. And he's going through that shoulder blade like it's nothing. Well, I'm going to wind this clip out. I hope you enjoyed it. I uh, also started a new Instagram account. Uh, the name I use on Instagram is the same I use on YouTube, First 508 Airborne. Look it up and check it out. I've got lots of good pictures of the dogs. Thanks for watching. That's all, folks. Bye.